Ooh, slot machines. I mean, slot... No, I think I heard the first time. Oh, God. Dappers? Are those alligators? Dapper alligators? <laughs> I dig it. I dig it. Fat Cat, you got style, and your cronies got style. I'm using the blocks I can't do shit with, damn it. But yeah, from the map, it looks like this is the last level. So that whole kidnapped kitten thing was just a ruse, but, um... So I guess we're, we're rescuing uh, Gadget now? I guess that's what we're doing. I honestly don't even remember. I thought she escaped, actually, but... Hmm. I guess we'll find out. When we defeat the boss at the end of this level. Because it'll be the final boss. Spoiler, no it won't. There's another map. <laughs> ah, fuck. I got killed by an ape. Or a linebacker or something. Linebacker apes. But, but I don't even know. Oh! Memo to me, if you hold on to a bomb for too long, it explodes in your hands. Just like in real life. I don't even know where I was going with that. <laughs> oh well. Ooh. Yeah, I can't do anything with this block. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, just follow him. Why not? He kicks blocks out of my way for me, so I can't use them. Great. And plenty of if I took in the upper path would have been ant lions. So it's like it's like between a rock and a hard place, between the devil and the deep blue sea, all that good shit. I was about to yell final boss, but there are several reasons why that would have been incorrect. The starters, I'm not even at a boss right now. <laughs> and I did. Aha! Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Double no, I have to make a stack. And these blocks don't hurt enemies. Yep. Ah, oh, God. Ooh, big apple. Delicious. Ooh, all these goodies. Ooh, I bet I can make a skip piece up to that block on the left. I bet I can stop fucking up. Come on, Doc. Wake up and die right. Oh, come on, really? Oh, come on, this is getting comical. There we go, this should do it, right? What do I get? Yeah, yeah, what up? Oh, and I think I'm gonna make a staircase to get to the door as well. This definitely has an end game feeling. Go! Oh, oh, God, don't do that too many times, Doc. Don't do that too many times. I better make one more just to be safe. Alright, final boss against Fat Cat himself, who doesn't look anything like Fat Cat. Oh, fuck. Basically, you just wanna... He only has certain angles he can shoot his projectiles at, so you kinda wanna trick him out between diagonal left and straight down, then slip in, throw the ball, and repeat. Frankly, the spikes are more of a concern to me than the projectiles, because it's really easy to accidentally trip on them. The hit detection on spikes in this game is pretty iffy in general. If you get anywhere near them, you tend to take damage, but we beat the game, yeah! And we still get a bonus level! Wait, I already spoiled it. This isn't the end, didn't I? What ends? Yay! We rescued Gadget! Yay! Oh, but Fat Cat's getting away, but we don't want to let him get away, so we're gonna chase him. To the moon, apparently. Sure, why not? Oh, no, we're going back down to Earth. We're just using the rocket to travel. It's like that thing you go a million miles straight up and then you travel an inch. But uh, okay. Three more levels, H, I, and J. I guess that makes there a total of ten levels if you don't include the tutorial level. Eleven if you do. And these guys really remind me of the crab enemies from the classic Mario Brothers. Not in the way they attack or move or anything, just in the way they look. They look exactly like them. Look at them again the next time they come around. Trust me, we'll be seeing them again. For example, now. <laughs> Yeah. Hmm. I really don't like being beneath those guys. So naturally, the game makes you climb up when they're gonna be above you. I wonder how you get those, by the way. Oh well. Yeah, what were they called? Side steppers? 
I know the turtles, people generally call them Koopas or Koopa Troopas, but they were actually, I believe, called shell creepers, and the crabs were sidesteppers, and the flies were, I do believe, fighter flies. Hee hee hee. Goodbye. Aw, oh, man. Flying squirrels with Fonzie jackets. Thought we had seen the last of them. Thought wrong. <laughs> oh well. Where are we, anyways? It's like the ubiquitous sewer level. Every video game needs a sewer level. It's hard to think of a game that doesn't have one. Hell, the original Mario Brothers was all a sewer level, and I strapped it on my own head. Great. That's water below us, by the way, in case you can't tell. Fall into it, it's instant death. Because chipmunks cannot swim. Or can they? Well, they can't in this game. And neither can my doppelgangers. Ah, oh, yes, why not? But then doppelgangers change back. Yeah, the first time you meet that enemy... And the first time you meet that enemy... Hmm, what the hell was that? Phone just started making noise. Get the shit out of me. It's down on the floor. <sighs> yeah, the first time I encountered that enemy, it really freaked me out as a little kid. I'm like, I'm like, hey, I beat the level. No, I'm like, hey, I have encountered my. Actually, as a little kid, I didn't realize that it was a doppelganger. I thought it was the other chipmunk. <laughs> okay, Gadget's going back to headquarters, so there's officially no reason for us to be doing any of this now. Unless we just want to get revenge on Fat Cat in general, because going after Fat Cat is a good thing to do. But I guess it is, because he's a bad guy. I mean, I don't know exactly. I mean, he kidnapped this and did that, and... I remember those fuckers. Eat your blocks and spit them black. Spit them black. Yeah, that's great. There's a way you can kill them, but it's. I think it's. it's I think I'll never know what it is. 